Hi guys, it's me, the Arcana Angel, and I am going to do another um, read for you today. Don't know who, don't know why, don't know what you're going through. All I know is I'm spirit-led, cornbread-fed from the south, and I'm ready to guide you whatever spirit um, have me to say. Pass on the messages. Just remember, don't shoot the messenger. I'm just... uh. <laughs> delivering what i see you know um i hope you like it if you like it thumbs up this video make sure you subscribe make sure you hit the bell so you don't miss your messages because i don't pick the signs naturally spirit does that because spirit knows who's in the most need so surrendering to god calling in the spirit of wisdom and truth scorpio and aquarius I already did Aquarius today, so maybe um the Scorpio, I mean maybe the Aquarius have Scorpio in their chart somewhere. Look up, make sure you look up your um astrological chart. Look, Aquarius, I'm telling you, whoever is an Aquarius out there, they really needs to look at that message. I'm gonna, hopefully, hopefully, if you are looking at these videos, you are listening to Spirit as well. One card. Okay, Queen of Swords. We got Virgo and Libra. Well, we already did Virgos. So maybe, um, Virgo, you got Libra in your chart. You're dealing with a Libra or something. Go check out that Virgo video. Look, Scorpio and Aquarius. And that was the Queen of Swords and King of Swords. So it's divine partnership this message may be about a divine partner ace of wands fire signs okay fire signs you up brand new passionate beginning six of wands at the bottom leo at the bottom so pay attention to this message Make sure you go check out those other videos because they've been crossing over. Look, there's the uh, King of Swords again. So it's just somebody's either dealing with an air sign or they ready, they planning and strategizing, ready, waiting for the right time to make a move on something. So let's see what y'all planning and strategizing. Ace of Wands, that's definitely brand new movement. And thank God you're doing it. You're making plans. So you ain't just running and jumping into something. There you are, fire sign, queen of wands, fresh out the dick. And three of pentacles, what you working on? I told you, working, planning, uh, you coming up. You coming up that ladder. The devil in reverse, removing uh, toxic situations, removing toxic patterns, removing toxic thoughts. Using your heart and what you've been taught all along to come up. Yeah, see? The Hermit card. Retrospect. What else for the... Yeah, the, the wheel. Completion. Something that changed in the atmosphere. Something you used to want, you don't want it no more. Poor babies. Sometimes that's a good thing. Oh, yeah. The nine of pentacles and the lovers, you made a decision to do what's best for yourself. And it's going to bring stability. You know, the nine of pentacles is a person that's happy with their self. And they heart, they use their intuition, they know. And the lovers, that's a decision to, to do what's best for yourself. Yeah, page of swords. You might not know all the details, but you're using your good feeling to just jump out there. You ready to take that leap? You ready to take that leap, but you you thinking about it. You ain't just jumping, though. That's good. Now, you manifesting. The star card, you're trying to, you're trying to heal, but you might be looking to the wrong things to manifest this beginning or are you looking at the wrong things within yourself two of ones yeah it looks like he conflicted within himself 
So, anything else from this stick for the fire signs? Anything else from this stick for the fire signs? You got the three to the ten, the nine to the ten. You you definitely elevating. This definitely about um, personal structure. I don't see any cups here. Any cups? You got the well. There they are, the emperor and the six of cups. You know, uh, making a stern decision, standing by what you know, and, and speaking what you know, getting the intuitive downloads. The Six of Cups is nostalgia, um, reminiscing, thinking about stuff. But you ain't thinking about it no more. That, that boat, what they say, that dog ain't hunting her no more. You ain't thinking that you ready to move, progress, tired of talking to Will and Cain. Look, there go the Ace of Swords. I'm ready to cut you off, and I'm ready to start my own thing. Try to move away from the heartbreak and do what's best for me. Told you. Ready to move away from the heartbreak and do what's best for me. What's going to bring me self-fulfilling and emotional instability. Yep. You got it. So, what's the steps? Anything else? What's the steps? What's the steps? Ooh, it's been a burden, though. But after the 10, remember, come to 1. You got two 10s. So, definitely something new that you manifesting. There's the one right there. You manifesting. And something goes shock somebody. Drive whatever you manifest. The decision that you make just might mess somebody's head up. You see the king and the queen, they falling out the table. So, and that's with the seven of cups. That new beginning. But it's going to bring you fulfillment. The empress, page of pentacles is the key. To your unknown. Oh, it's the key to your success. Let's see. What else? For the fire signs. I'm not going to be long with y'all. Y'all just got a video yesterday. You know what you need to do. You know what you need to do. And it seems like you're thinking about your money. You're putting your focus on your money. Taking action. Oh, you know what you need to do. And purify yourself. Letting go of those fears that no longer serve you. Letting go of the things that no longer serve you. That's the devil card in reverse. Six movement. The void. Yeah, it's been a heavy burden. One, two, one. Make sure you look up this numerology. One, two, one. Um, the void and resilience. Yeah, you've been through a lot, but you in a dark place, but you about to come out. About to come out. Just have patience. Your peace, pleasure is coming. Just self-love. Reflect on, like I said, making the decision to do what's best for you. That's what you need to reflect on during this time. Anything else? Last thing? Anything else? Yeah. Trust the process. The growth is here. Change and change. It's, it's a new day. I told you. Ain't that dog ain't hunting no more. Growth and trust. Um, trust the process within the week. Remember, I told you within the week, um, something major is going to happen. You either going to get enlightened or man, it's something good. I can feel it. I don't know about you, but I can definitely, uh, I can feel it. It's something good is about to happen to y'all. Yep. Two of cups. I told you I could feel it. Now the two of cups is coming together. The Two of Cups is emotionally uh, fulfilling. It's balance. You know, it's balance of the masculine and the fi uh, feminine. It's being able to speak your truth. It's getting the intuitive downloads. It's that, man, it's on, It's movement. It's definitely a uh, movement. I told you it's something good on the way. And I see it. Stability. There you go. Um, Fire signs. Make sure you like this video. Drop me a comment and let me know what that new beginning is. And till next time. Namaste.